welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a holiday makeup for you guys, Euphoria style. So I am using a bunch of crystals in my eye. It is very trendy right now and I really wanted to create this for you guys. The eye is super simple. We basically just did a smoky with really flawless photogenic skin and glossy nude lips. This is the type of makeup that you can wear any color of clothes. It's gonna go with everything. And of course, you'll also be able to use this throughout next year for a night out because it's very trendy right now. So I really hope you guys like it. I love you guys so much. Let's get to it. <laughs> okay, so I started doing the eye so I could do the other one with you guys, but I'm gonna do skin first because I realized it would be easier to do the skin first and then apply all of the crystals. So we're gonna do skin, okay? We're not gonna talk much through skin, but then I'll talk more through the eyes. So I have hydrated my skin, lots of serum, make it shiny and glowy so that your foundation sinks in. And I'm gonna use the Shiseido foundation today. Beauty Blender and blend all of that in. Now we'll apply concealer. I'm gonna use my NARS one and I like to apply the concealer, go up here and I like to let it dry a little bit after I apply it. So I move on and do something else so that when we blend it, it has more coverage and it gives you kind of like a lift. So while concealer dries a little bit, I'm, gonna to, I'm going to apply primer on my eyes. I'm liking this Dior one from this um, Dior palette. It's really good. The palette that I'm gonna use today for the eyes is this one from NARS. It's the Skin Deep. It has all neutral colors. And I'm gonna take the beige color and apply it under my brows. Now we can blend concealer. A little more concealer. I feel tired today. <laughs> Translucent powder by Fenty. Take the excess out. Okay, so while the skin bakes in that powder, we're gonna finish the eyes, okay? So, I'm gonna do this one like exactly how I did this, and then we'll move on and do everything else together. So I'm gonna start with this shadow that's like a light brown eyeshadow, but it's colder. So it has more of a grayish undertone and we're gonna take a blending brush and just blend all of the lid area 
going up to the crease. Same shadow, but a more dense brush. We're gonna blend it down here on our bottom eye. And then we're gonna take a shimmery shadow from the Huda palette and apply it under the brow. You can't really see this in camera, but it's very beautiful. It's filled with glitters. And now I'll mix just a little bit of the light and dark shadow, a little tiny bit, and you still take the excess out of it and apply it on the outer corner. Just to make sure we darken this a little bit. So we'll have like a very grayish brown, light grayish brown, smoky. And then we're gonna create a little line, liner. I'm gonna take my, I'm gonna take my Marc Jacobs eye pencil just line from the outer corner to the center of your eye really close to the rash really close to the lash root and then what i'm gonna do is take a little tiny brush like this and black shadow and just trace it on top of that and we're gonna create a little line here so you pull it out and this brush will help you out if you want to do this with liquid liner or gel liner you can but it just looks nicer and it's easier to do too with the shadow Okay, so we have a little liner there, and now we're gonna start applying all of our crystals and make it euphoria. And then we'll do lashes at the end so that when we're applying the crystals, it doesn't mess it up, okay? So for crystals, I got this at Amazon. Just went on Amazon and put face eye crystals, and it came in this little package here. It says Tech Unite 2000 piece um clear crystals <laughs> and it came with this all sizes all sizes you can think of and it's really cool because you can just put it away really easily it came with a tweezer and um face glue okay skin glue so what i'm gonna do basically is just play around with it i'm gonna use the smaller sizes mostly uh, from 7 to 12. 1 to 6 is really big. So for my eyes, the biggest I will use is number 7. So first, I don't know if this is the easiest way to do it, you guys, but that's how I'm going to do it. So I put the glue on my hand. At the end of the tweezer closed, I put it in the glue and then I come in and dot it wherever I want to put the crystal. So I'm gonna put two bigger ones here, like I did on this side, in have to be patient here because sometimes you do have to be patient 
because you know sometimes you come in and it drops and I mean just make sure the glue dries a little bit before you stick it in there and then I'm just gonna keep doing this around my whole eye so I'll mix big and small throughout okay and you can play around with it you can do all your whole eyelid you can do whatever you want so I came in here and you can play this however you want. So I did a row under the liner and now I'm gonna pull this out a little bit. And it doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be like, just keep doing it. Use small ones, big ones, and just play with it. Okay, so this is it. I basically put them all around here big and small and then i created a trail of medium and small ones around my eyelid okay but like i said play with it you can just put it on the outer corner of your eye you're just in the inner corner of your eye it will look so pretty as well but i decided to put it all around okay i'm gonna do the second eye and i'll be right back it takes a little bit okay that's it and now we are going to apply false lashes i'm gonna use my number 21 from ardell i'm gonna glue them in should use a mirror to do that I'm gonna apply white liner on the waterline to open our eye more. Okay, we're done with the eyes. Now I'm just gonna finish the skin with you guys. I'm gonna get my Givenchy bronzer and start contouring a little bit here. I'm gonna bronze my forehead as well. I'm gonna get Hula, which is a more brown undertone and just contour a little bit more. Contour my nose a little bit. Dior highlighter, tip of the nose. Chin and Cupid's bow. And of course, we're gonna highlight a little bit here. Now for blush, we're gonna use a pink blush because we just go with all the grays we have going on. And I'm gonna use this one from Too Faced, which is uh, the color disappeared, but it's the only pink one they have with the hearts. For lips, I'm gonna contour with Patrick Ta's She's Proud. which is a gorgeous nude. And I'm gonna fill it in. Oh gosh, you guys, I just noticed. <laughs> I went to grab lipstick and I came back. I thought it was still filming, but not. So I applied the um, Parisian nude, which is a color that I created with Lancome. And on top of it, I applied gloss from Patrick Ta. And this is the final look. And now 
I'm gonna show you my look. I am wearing a Camilla Quiller collection holiday dress and it is available at revolve.com for you guys. I don't know when I'm gonna put this video up. It's a very flattering dress. It's loose all around, so you don't have to worry about anything around here. You can also belt it, but I love it like this. Long sleeve and just loose with a little mock neck. So that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the makeup. This makeup you can wear uh, with basically any color of clothes. I love you and I'll see you in 2020 probably. Mm.